pixels.coo Welcome. We've already opened PaintShop Pro, as you can see. Now we're using the complete workspace for all the PaintShop Pro explainers, so just make sure it's selected. If you're using an earlier version of this software, you'll find there weren't any workspaces to choose between, but this explainer will still work just fine. Click the Edit tab at the top here. We're going to need a photo to work with. To open a file, go to the File menu here at the top left and click on Open. Navigate to the folder on your computer where the image you want to use is stored and double click on it to open it. This rather fun photo was taken at a Chinese lantern event and it has a, a sort of celebratory birthday theme. So we're going to add some text to it. We're going to add happy birthday to it towards the bottom left down here. Start by clicking on the text tool over here. Now click roughly where you'd like the top left of your text to be. You can change this later. The text toolbar automatically opens and it runs across the top of the window from left to right up here. I'm going to type the word happy and just see what the default text looks like. Okay, obviously it's very, very small, but at least the white text is visible on the dark background. To make changes to the text, we're going to need to highlight it. Just double click on it to do this. My first issue is that it's almost too small to see. So let's make it bigger by adjusting the size up here. Play around with the size as you need to. I'm going to leave it on one to eight for now. Next, the font is rather boring. Let's find a font that looks a bit more cheerful. I rather like Fredoka One. You can of course choose any font you like. Now press enter and then type the word birthday. New text will continue to use the font and the font size we've already chosen. You may need to confirm you're done editing the text before you're able to move it around. In this case, look for a green tick icon. To move the text, move your mouse pointer to the very center of the box and just hold down your left mouse button to move it around like this. You can also resize the text by grabbing and dragging one of the corners, a bit like this. This text is looking pretty good, so I think it's time to save my image as a new file. To do this, go to the File menu at the top left and click on Save As. Give the new image a sensible name, a bit like this, so you can find it easily later on, and click on Save. And there you go. Pixels.cool